money class two. Let's do science chapter four domestic animals. So class two, you know that in the last class we have done wild animals and their homes, isn't it? So now this is our new chapter that is domestic animals. We know that wild animals live in forest. There are some animals that we keep at home or in farms. They are called domestic animals. So, in the last uh, chapter, we have learned about uh, wild animals that wild animals live in forest or in jungle, isn't it? So now, the animals. But there are some animals that we keep at our homes or in farms. That animals are called domestic animals. So what are called domestic animals? Animals that we keep at our home or in farms. Okay. That animals are called domestic animals. These animals are very useful to us in one or the other way. So we tame them. So these animals, uh, please look at this picture. Camel, cow, goat. Some example I have given. So these animals are very useful to us and these are very useful in many ways. Okay. So that is why we tame them and we uh, keep these animals at our home. We make homes for some animals. So that is why if we keep these animals at our home, we must, we should uh, make the homes to these animals, isn't it? The cow and the calf. The cow lives in a shed. This is shed, okay, where the cow lives. Uh, this is house of the cows, okay. And the cow eats grass. So we all know that cow eat grass only. A young cow is called a calf. So the baby cow is called a calf. Okay. And the cow gives us milk. So we get milk from cows. Okay. Next one is hen in a coop. The hen and the chicken. The hen has a chicken. A chicken hatches from an egg. Of course, we get chicks from the eggs. And hens and chickens live in a pen or a hen house. This is house of the hen. It is called pen. P-E-N. Pen. Okay. And the hen gives us eggs and meat. So, we eat eggs and meat of hen also. That means... Hen give us eggs and meat, okay? So, goes. this is pen or we can say poop also, okay? So, house of hen. Horse in a stable. The horse helps the farmer in the fields. A young horse is called a foal. Uh, the horse lives in a stable. So, this is the home of a Horse, it is called stable. S T A B L E, stable. Okay, this is house of horse. We can keep or we keep horse in a stable. Okay, and the baby, a young horse, is called foal. Okay, horse live in a stable, and horse helps the farmer in the fields. Pig in pig stay. The pig lives in a pig stay. Pig stay means the home of a pig is called pig stay. A young pig is called a piglet. The young pig means the baby of a pig is called piglet. The pig gives us meat. Yes, the pig gives us meat. We call it pork. Okay. Bacon is made from the pig's meat. So, bacon is made from the pig's meat. Fish in an aquarium. 
The fish lives in the sea also and it can live in an aquarium. So uh, if we can um, keep fish at our home then we must have aquarium to keep the fish. Okay. And uh, fish can be keep, kept as pets. We, we eat fish. Okay. So we can uh, keep uh, we can keep fish as pet animals and we eat fish also. Now cat as pet. The cat is also a domestic animal and it is kept as a pet. A young cat is called a kitten. Okay. Kitten is a young cat or baby cat is called kitten. The cat catches mice. Okay. The cat catches mice. Rabbit in a burrow. A young rabbit is called a bunny. This means, means the baby, this is a small rabbit, the baby rabbit is called bunny. The rabbit lives in a hutch or burrow. So you can say, okay. And it can be kept as a pet or for its meat. Okay. So some people, some people, they eat the meat of um, rabbit also. And we can keep as pet animals. Birds in a nest. The bird lives in the nest. Some birds live in a cage. The bird is insect. A young bird is called a nestling. This is a nest of a bird where the birds live. Okay, this is a house of a bird. And the baby of a bird is called nestling. Animals such as cow, buffalo and hen are mostly kept in farms. These animals are called farm animals. So, some animals like cow, buffalo and hen, we can kept in farms. These animals are called farm animals. Animals like cat, dog, rabbit and parrot are kept at home. These animals are called Pet animals. So animals like cat, dog, rabbit and parrot. This we can keep at home. These animals are called pet animals. So now hope you all have understood TVR. Let's continue in the next video. Thank you class.